Today we're going to discuss how to hook the Arduino Uno R3 and a CNC Shield version 3 along with four 8825 stepper motor drivers to a Mac. The first thing I did was hop on eBay and look for an auction and I found one that had a clone of an Uno R3 and I don't know if it's a real CNC shield or if it's a clone as well but um, it was cheap and I figured if I'm going to fail on this project I might as well fail for less money so I ordered it not expecting a whole lot and it arrived quickly by UPS the first thing I noticed is there was a USB cable included which I thought was pretty nice because most of the time those things don't seem to show up the next thing in the box is the Arduino R3 card and this is a clone but it says that it's an Arduino on it and I don't know whether to believe them or not but I'm gonna believe not the first thing I did was download the Arduino software from the Arduino website once you get the Arduino software rolling the first thing to do is identify what kind of card you have. So I just selected Arduino from the drop down. Then you simply connect the Arduino with the USB cable to the Mac. The next thing you need to do is download the GRBL to Arduino library. And you can get this on GitHub. Uh, on there, it'll be a zip file. And you unzip that zip file and put the library into the libraries folder in the Mac. Once you load the sketch into the Arduino, it should be ready to go. You'll see lights blinking and that sort of thing. The next thing you'll want to do is unplug everything from the Arduino now that you know that it just works. Then you can start to plug in the CNC shield to the Arduino. And it's really simple. The pins just line up and you just push it into place. Oh, yeah. After the CNC shield is in place, then you want to connect the stepper motor drivers to the card. There's four of them, and you have to pay attention to the orientation of them, but it's, it's pretty simple. Once you have all of that together, you can plug it back into the USB. The next thing you'll need is a G-code sender, and I downloaded the universal G-code sender. It's free of charge, it's freeware, and it's JavaScript, so it runs both on Mac and PC. Inside the Universal G-Code Sender, uh, you just go to the drop-down and you need to find your USB port, and it's pretty simple. There's only a couple of them, and they have a TTY in the name. Once you have all of that, your CNC shield and Arduino should be working just fine and now it's time to hook it up to motors and make sure it goes. That's it for today. Don't let your meat loaf.